All right, so here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Oh, so the taller fighter lands a flush knee. Wow, huge head kick. Saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Big kick. Able to check that kick as well. These guys throwing early. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Just out of range with the big right hand. Got the single collar tie. Keep your hands up. Use your footwork now. It's okay. Use your footwork. And once again, looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Straight right. Real nice body kick land. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land from anywhere. Missed with that right hand. And both guys really throwing with authority. So he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quick. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind an educated jab. Straight right hand now just misses. Liver kick. Nice punch, man. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. You got to check these low legs. Oh, over the top. This fight's going to be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very bad. He went high on that one. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. What a punch. Head kick. Albu's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Oh, huge right hand. Oh. Diving punch lands. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Got clip with the right hand. All right, working inside the closed guard now. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, so good ground and pound by him here, certainly staying busy, and not just busy, but effective. You can just throw punches to keep the referee off of you. This guy is throwing punches to be effective, to throw damaging strikes. He's doing a fantastic job. Oh, wow, that happened quickly as the fighter reverses position there on the ground. Unbelievable position change. Wow, what a transition. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Ten seconds to go. Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. 
Five minutes in the books. All right, that's the end of the round. He's got a cut on his cheek from that round. There are certainly worse locations for a cut on the cheek. It's not going to trickle down into the eye. Nonetheless, pretty significant gash. We'll see if the cut man can close it up. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. Are you ready? You ready? Second round underway. Oh, effective strike there by Alpine. under the elbow. Keep oh, that couldn't have felt good as he lands the knee to the body. He's a tall fighter and he's going to have the size advantage against most opposition in this division. to connect with the right. Look at him yank the head and land that beautiful punch to the clinch. Oh, that uppercut landed for him. Oh! Now his lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Oh! Some real power shots here! Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high. And now he's got him hurt bad. Great punch landed with so much power. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily win. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. And now he's got that tie clinch. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Just misses with the straight right. That one's not him. Nice strike. Misses with the right hand. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that one. Wow! And just like that, the fight is over. He got him! Oh, my goodness. What a fight. Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight, landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. All right, let's re-rack the highlight now, DC. And he's certainly going to enjoy watching this one back. The head kick was there early, he was there often, and ultimately ended the night for his opponent. He found a weakness in his opponent's game. The left kick, over and over, he was able to land it. And he was landing the strikes, too, with his hands. But ultimately, it was the kick that was hidden behind the punch that finished the fight for him. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 35 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout Oh, there he is after a huge knockout win.